What is going on guys back to some more Dragon Ball Z Joken Battle videos on the global version and we have some gameplay I've not done global gameplay in a minute I've been doing a ton of Japan stuff and uh, we've been doing a fuck ton of summons but we're now going to do some gameplay we're going to have Buhan vs Buhan today and I haven't done that one uh, ever actually I never had Buhan vs Buhan huh but this is actually the first time that I'm really trying out my uh, new intelligence team my new Buhan team Looks like I'm gonna have to take and look at this. Look at this non doken Buhan. This filthy SA8 Buhan. How dare you awaken Buhan without mastering him out? That is disgusting. That is fucking nasty. Uh, but nonetheless, we're gonna have to take him. So, this is the mono intelligence team. Let's see the ores that we have here. Uh, gonna change up that fruit of might for something else. I don't need it. Uh, this team is pretty freaking good with, with key because we have Turles and other units. Uh, providing key for us, so we need just something else to replace it with. Uh, reduce all enemies attack. I guess we'll take this. I mean, I'm never going to use it beyond this, but... Oh, well, so this is team. So, double Buhan, my Buhan, FSA 10. Fuck the Ant. We have two Andrews in this freaking lineup. Fuck both the Andrews, but... We have Android 13. He changes orbs to rainbow orbs. Freaking clutch. We have Jinin, but he's awoken. Android, uh, what is this? 18? Yeah. <laughs> wow, I had to fly in my mouth. <laughs> That's disgusting. Turles, and we have intelligent cells let's get on to it guys so like I said this is my first time really running my Buhan team I just awoke in Buhan not too long ago haven't really had a chance to run him on the uh, team or run him at all actually because I've been I've been back and forth with playing JP and also playing global and I'm also playing Naruto Awesome Ninja Blazing as well I'm getting more into that game you guys will be seeing some more stuff on the game coming to the channel so I hope you appreciate Nerd to Ultimate Ninja Blazing, making a good amount of uh, videos on the channel. I hope you guys are into that because it will be happening. Just letting you know, it will be happening. But this is actually my first time, like I said, looking through uh, what Buhan's capable of. So, uh, this is actually a good time for us to do it together because you guys can see as well. Now, a lot of key for Janimba, not bad at all. Like I say, this this team really doesn't have an issue with getting key because we have a lot of uh, units who are changing orbs. We have a lot of units who are providing key, you know, like Perilous, he gives. Three key for every single character in the lineup as a passive when you're HP 50% or above. Now keeping your HP 50% or above with this lineup is not a big not a big issue at all uh, because we have Buhan and Heels. Perfect start out, we have Buhan and Android. Well actually I want Janimba. But uh Okay, we're gonna have to push Android 18 out of here for a second because I want Janimba to tank those hits. Just in case if he supers. So we're going to do that, uh, going to start off with uh, just getting those orbs real quick. And uh, this seems to be the path that gives us the most orbs, if you don't know. Buhan is a nuker, so the more orbs he gets, the better. Um, and I don't really care about giving him a super, I really don't. He's literally only here for his passive. He's literally only here to change fucking orbs. So, uh, Janimba coming in clutch, I'm going to say Buhan. Janimba coming in clutch with the freaking counters, not the counters, he doesn't counter, with the freaking blocks. And uh, pretty good. Do not super Buhan. Do not super Android 13, please. I cannot take no fucking hits. He's gonna lower his attack and defense. He's a debuffer. So Buhan is already debuffing. So not bad. I'll do not super. Do not. F oh yes, thank you. Do not fucking super. Now uh, this is not a bad lineup. Wow, he's attacking a lot right there. Fuck. We're gonna go ahead and pop the item we brought. We're gonna be reducing damage. I should pop this in the beginning. Uh, we're gonna reduce all attack to 25%. So that's nice. That's cool. Let's see if we can get through this entire thing without using. Any healing items, let's see if it's possible. Uh, gonna collect those. Turles, he only needs two. Uh, we'll give him this. And then the android, she can go ahead and have those to get herself a super attack. So not bad, do not super, do not perfect, perfect, thank you, thank you, thank you. We can already see the difference with the debuffing. Uh, and also I have the 25% uh, reduction in damage given, or, you know, given by me. Uh, put on to me? Fuck that up, don't you? Stun, Turles, stun! Did we get the stun? I don't know. I think we got the stun. Did we get the stun? We probably got the stun. I'm going to check in a second. In a long second because this is a long animation. If we got the stun or not. Uh, we got the stun lit. Freaking amazing. So we have the combination of Janimba and Buhan. I need to awaken that sub. I really need to awaken so Definitely. Um, so we're going to do this. Buhan's going to get those orbs. And guys, we don't have anything to stop him from healing. I don't have any units that have power bestowed by God. That's intelligence. So he's going to heal all the way back up, which is fine. Uh, and then we're going to have to kill him and then get his health, get his health back down. So I know it's going to happen. I, I'm not, we're not going to avoid it, uh, but it's fine, whatever. So that's going to make the match a little longer, which kind of sucks. But 
nonetheless, we are going to get it done. We will achieve victory, guys. So it will be happening. Now we have Android 18. Android 13. Fuck, man. I'm fucking these Androids. Android 13 with Buhan, which is what you want. So he's going to constantly be changing orbs for Buhan. And uh, that's going to give Buhan a more powerful super attack. Uh, we can get a super attack with you. Why not? Sterless, you can come. Sterless. Sterless? Come in clutch with the stun, please. Yes. Uh, we have yet to see a ghost come. Oh, this guy is only in SA8. He can't do the ghost. Kamikaze Kamehameha attack. What a fucking... Uh, get your Buhans to SA10. Do not awaken Buhan. If he's not in SA10, literally, like... His best attack is when he's in an SA10. He has a 30% 30 chance to do the Super Ghost Kamikaze attack. But uh, this guy, he's in SA8, so we don't have the chance. We just have Buzz Shouts. So it's up to my Buhan to do pretty much all the, the uh, debuffing. Which is fine, whatever. Uh, so we're going to put Janimba there to counter those hits. Uh, we're going to do this so we can get my Buhan a super, not a lot of orbs, but nonetheless, I'll take a super um, over, not supering. And uh, Android 18, she's only here to change orbs. The Androids are only here to change orbs. That's literally the only reason why they're on the team. Literally the only reason. Go ahead and super attack Janimba. He's a freaking beast. He can tank any hit. It's fucking fine. So our only real hitters are the Buhans. Uh, Cell, I need awaken Cell, I really need awaken him. His event needs to come back around second awaken the motherfucker. Um, Janimba is decent, he can, you know, do, you know, 100k damage. But, you know, of course, Boo has a barrier. So we're not gonna see what Janimba can really do here, but, oh well. Beautiful, thank you, Android 18, for coming. 13, I keep fucking calling him 18. Ugh, but, you know, I, I never thought I was be thanking a fucking Android, but, you know, thanks for coming clutch, bitch. Uh, so yeah, there we go, guys, so... You know, like you said, this is going to be a long fight, a long video. Go ahead and grab your popcorn, go get some coconut water, go get something comfortable to drink and eat and sit in, because we're going to be here for a minute. Because next round, when he transforms into Bukalo, he's going to heal all his HP. But that's fine. Have you guys noticed we haven't used a healing item yet? No healing items at all needed, because Buhan, he heals himself. And now uh, we have the Androids coming around every single time changing orbs, so it's like you're getting... Maximum heals every single time, so it's like it's a winning situation. Literally, it's a winning situation. So maximum orbs here. Okay, I'm gonna give you number that, and then we're gonna take Buhan over here to get all of those orbs. Give me the heals. We're almost at full health once again. And a Turles can probably get a stun. Maybe, maybe. Can I get a stun, Turles? Can you stun for me, BP? Da -da 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 -da. I don't have hate if you guys are wondering. I didn't summon on the um the universe six. Uh, the Universe 6, Universe 7 banner. So we don't have hit. And I didn't do any summons on the Super Saiyan Blue Kai Ken banner either. So I didn't have a chance to get hit. But I don't really care for hit. He's a stunner. But he's not the best stunner in the world. Uh, he needs a rebirth. All he needs is shocking speed. And maybe one attack link and he'll be good to go. We bring the camera in a little bit more. Just I don't want to lose the light. Because it's kind of it's kind of getting into evening time. Uh, but oh well, so we're gonna do this, and then, oh, Buhan doesn't have a lot of orbs here, fuck, but we're gonna have to put Android 18 there. And then we're gonna do this, that should drop the purples, perfect. Not that I need the purples, actually, I'm just gonna take the blue, I don't Oh, fuck, I fucked up, I fucked up. Well, what, I wasn't, I wasn't thinking, I fucked up. Anyways, whatever. You know, shit happens, you know, we don't pay attention sometimes, I wasn't paying attention. I thought Buhan only needed four orbs, but he needed like five. So that sucks. But oh well, nonetheless, we're still getting the work done, guys. We're still making the magic happen with the GG win, guys. GG. Now this is where he's gonna heal, and this is where the part fucking sucks. Like all of that HP that we worked so hard to take away will be given back, and uh, we're just gonna have to take it. We just have to take it. Like you know, we're. We're just getting fucked, you know, like, we're, we're, we're gonna just have to take the fucking that we're about to get right now, because there's nothing you can do. You you can't fight it, you can't reason with it, it's just gonna happen, so just take it. Just, just, just give it to me. I can't do anything, just give it to me. But it only lasts for three turns, so like I said, he will most likely 100% guarantee have full health at the end of it, which is whatever. So... Uh, we're going to kill him in his tech form, so when he gets into the tech form of Majin Buu, then that is where we're going to cause damage and kill him and get that KO. 
Now, next turn, he's going to be turned into his physical form, and that's going to be, uh, it's not going to be difficult at all. Uh, but his physical form is going to cause a bit of problem because we have the type disadvantage. But we can still get the work done, guys. You best believe that. So we're going to do this, get all those orbs, give me all my health back. Thank you. Uh, I don't care about Android 13 getting a super, but he's going to get one. And uh, I care about Turles because Turles stuns. If Turles can stun for the last turn, then we can mitigate his healing, which would be freaking awesome. So let's see Turles going to come and clutch for us. I'm going to turn on the light, you know, it's getting a little dark. There we go, light on, light poo! I see the timer on the camera. Okay, we are we are about 11 minutes in, guys, so we are actually a GG. So, so far, we're not doing bad. Turles, can you come and clutch with the stun and save us one turn of healing? Nope, he didn't stun. He didn't stun, guys, so whatever, that's fine. I expected him to go all the way health, so... Whatever! Uh, Buhan has a lot of orbs. That's a lot of fucking orbs. And I'm going to take all those orbs for myself. Oh, we have a Dokkan mode, but it's going to... We have a Dokkan mode after he fucking heals, so that sucks. Um, so he's going to pretty much heal all the damage we're about to do, but... Oh, well. Oh, well. It is what it is. I wish I got a Dokkan mode in the next round, but... You can't win them all, Bob! Oh, no, no, no! <laughs> that went fast. <laughs> Fucked up on two, but... The no combo doesn't really matter because, like I said, he's going to heal all the damage that we're about to do to him. I haven't seen one Ghost Kamikaze attack yet. I haven't seen one. And I know only my Buhan can do it, but come on now, I mean, not one. Fuck you. Fuck you, Bukalo, but whatever. We're still going to kill you. You're still going to get the damage given to you. So, Janimba, I love Janimba's attack. So freaking clutch. So freaking awesome. He's at an SA1. I really want to get him to at um, an SA10 because... And SV10, he can do substantial damage, actually. He can hit over 200k easy. So I definitely want to get Janimba over. Um, not over, but I want to get him at an SV10. Because he's going to be in my team pretty much forever. Like, I don't think there's going to be a unit who's going to be replacing him for a while. We're going to do this because I want to get those purples down so I can get all those. There we go, because that's a lot more than what the blues were. Beautiful! Full health! And we're gonna get Cell a super. Cell going. Cell's not gonna. Oh, fucking. Cell's not gonna get a super. Oh well. Oh well. Cellular device. Cellular device. Shout out to Omega Pro. I've been watching that dude's uh, old Dokkan videos. He need to get back to Dokkan because I mean I understand Dokkan. It's kind of hard to do videos on Dokkan all the time because of summons and whatnot and the gameplay. I, I get it. I fucking get it. My dude's doing some Xenoverse, but he's actually one of my favorite Dokkan YouTubers, Omega Pro. So. For the, you know, the chance of him watching this video, I don't even know, I don't even think it's going to happen, but, bro, you are one of my faves, man. Get back in the Dokkan, bro. So we took quite a bit of damage there, and uh, we don't have a lot of orbs to heal up with. I'm actually going to put Janimba in the first slot right there. Uh, okay, we are in a bit of a conundrum right here. Huh. This sucks. Um, alright, let's see what happens here. Uh, how's that gonna drop? Okay, there we go, we have a super. So, Janimba's gonna tank. And, uh, Buhan, we got a little bit of healing back from Buhan. And, uh, Toast doesn't have a super, but oh well. We're gonna check the timer once again, kinda see what time we're at, guys. Cause, I can only film 20 minutes of footage on this camera. Per clip. So, that sucks, but oh well. Uh, Buhan's gonna debuff. So, that's cool. If only we can do the ghost. Of course! Of course he supers me. Why not super Janimba? Oh, did I just die? I didn't die. I'm cool. I am still GG, guys. GG. So he is now in his tech form. And uh, this is going to be easy because we have the type advantage now. If only we could have had that Dokkan mode here. If only we could have had that Dokkan mode. Oh, boy. But, you know, we can't win them all. Uh, that's a lot of orbs. I'll take those orbs. We have yet to use a healing item. Oh no, I don't want to give all those orbs to any of the androids. Uh, okay, that works. That works. All those orbs are for the Buhan. My Buhan who can do Super Ghost Kamikaze attack. And uh, they both have the same amount of healing, so it doesn't really matter who really gets it. But uh, I like my Buhan more because he's maxed out. So yeah, that's that's a little bias, but whatever. So, oh, look at that wrestling gun, wrestling gun in Dragon Ball Z, if you guys have never seen that before. That pretty much is a freaking wrestling gun. It looks like it, at least. I'm going to restart the camera, and then I'm going to start playing again. So, I like, I need to reset the clip, because 20 minutes is almost up. So, one second, guys.
And we are back, so let's continue with the gameplay. So, oh, I gotta make Buhan take those hits because I want to get those orbs for Buhan, which is fine. We have the type advantage, so he's not going to kill us. We are not going to die. Not today, no sorry, Bob. Wow, notifications coming in. Why didn't I turn those off? I turned them off. What the fuck? Anyways, so this is where we're going to lay on some damage. Uh, this form and also his Kid Buu Tech form is where we're going to lay on some damage. So, yeah, look at that. We're doing over 200k damage now. So, this is where shit becomes easy, guys. We're getting the work done. If you don't have Buhan, then I feel low-key sorry for you because he's an amazing unit. But uh, we do have the God Banner that's going to be coming out within, you know, you can, you can say a month and a half. A month to a month and a half, yeah, because we still have Tech Goal and Freezer to go through. Then after Tech Goal and Freezer, I believe we have... Um, uh, we have Shinron, Omega Shinron, and then after Shinron we have Goku Black, and then after Goku Black is when we're going to have the actual ticket banner. So we have three banners, yeah, three banners um, before the God Banner comes out. Plus we might have some Dragon Ball Fusion banners because over on JP we got Dragon Ball Fusions and Dragon Ball Heroes. I doubt we're going to have the Dragon Ball Heroes banner because Dragon Ball Heroes is specifically just for JP. It doesn't have anything to do with Globe. There, there's no a uh, global English game that has that is Dragon Ball Heroes, so I doubt we're going to get that banner, I really freaking doubt it. Uh, but you know, most likely we'll be getting Dragon Ball Fusion because Dragon Ball Fusion is in English now. So we'll probably get that. So technically we have four banners uh, to go through before we can actually get um, the, uh, the the ticket banner. So you know, I think, I think a month and a half is a good estimation. Oh he's done, I didn't even notice that. I'm fucking talking here. And, Shit is happening. But uh, yeah, I think a month and a half, that's decently accurate. That is that's decent, where we can say that we'll get the uh, the golden ticket banner. In between that, you can maybe expect a world tournament. So there are things to do. I think uh, the next world tournament that they have here on Global, they might release the Intelligence Buhan. No, fuck Intelligence. They might release the Intelligence uh, Piccolo, uh, the LR Piccolo. So we might be getting that in the next world tournament. Do not quote me. I don't get my facts anywhere. I'm speculating because I'm just going based on how it went on JP. That's all I'm doing. So based on JP, if they follow the same pattern, then we should be getting LR Piccolo in the next World Tournament. We should be. And we should be getting Golden Freezer next week. We should be. And we should be getting Dragon Ball Fusion after that and then Shinron and then, you know, Goku Black. So we will see what happens with that. But we are almost done with the fight, guys. Uh, as you can see, it's not hard, it's just a long fight, because he heals up, we have to go through all the stages, and he has such a high fucking defense. So the fight is long, but by no means is it hard, like I'm talking here, I'm having a good time. And I'm also doing the game, like I'm barely paying attention, I'm just like clicking this shit. So, you know, Buhan is a game changer. Buhan literally is one of the best cards in the fucking game, like you really cannot go wrong with this card at all in any way, shape, or form. Like, it's just not gonna happen. So, Turles, I mean, if you want to stun, bro, go ahead and stun, but, you know, at, at this point, we're pretty much in the goal. We are in the goal, guys. Uh, we pretty much have achieved victory at this point because we're not going to die right now. It's not going to happen. Unless I, you know, slack off and, you know, fuck around. But, uh, of course, I won the victory. So, the only reason for me to do this event is to get the medals to wake my, my, uh, my, my, my Bukalo and our uh, tanks. My Bukalo is at an SA8, either 7 or 8, one of those. And then uh, my blue tank's like in an SA4, so I need to pull more of those guys. Uh, otherwise, I cannot awaken them, which low-key sucks. But oh well, I don't really need them. I mean, I would like to have Bukalo on his team because he's intelligent. And I could actually run him on this team, but I don't need him. I just want him. So, this should definitely bring him, you know, a little, a little bit above halfway. Uh, yeah, a little bit above halfway. Uh, within the next two rounds, he should be dead. He should be dead within the next two rounds. Easy. So after this, I'm actually going to be going to school. If you don't know, I am in college. Uh, and I am going for my associate's degree. Kind of kind of personal, kind of getting a little personal here. But, you know, just kind of letting you guys know what's going on. So I'm going to head to school. And uh, just have some homework assignments to do. And just have some stuff we need to catch up on. So this video won't be coming out, you know, for... A bit of a minute because I don't really have time to edit it right now but nonetheless guys you will be seeing this some sometime in the future so yeah that's what's up 
Uh, and if you're wondering, I'm two semesters away from getting my degree. Two semesters away, so I'm very... Finally, we have a Ghost Kamikaze pack, finally. Two semesters away from getting my degree. So, I am grinding in school right now, so, you know, maybe the uh, the uploads might, um, you know, not be as frequent soon. I mean, pretty much I'm doing every single day. And I've been doing every single day since October. Every single day you guys got a video from me. With, you know, in, in the past, like, two, two and a half months, I've uploaded a video every single fucking day. But, like I said, you know, school, you know, is a big priority. And, you know, I'm not going to compromise my education to upload a dog, upload a dog on video or YouTube video. I'm just not going to do it. That's, that's kind of stupid, actually. So, focusing on school, guys. So, just letting you guys know, if you see me miss a day, that is why. I'm studying, I'm in school, I'm doing shit with fucking school because I'm so close to finishing. I just want to get it out the way, get my fucking degree, and move on with my life. So, that is going on right now. But, uh, we're about to beat him. Can Android 18, fucking Android 18 again. Can Android 13, nope, he's not gonna do it. Uh, Turles is definitely gonna finish off for Turles. Come in clutch with the KO. And that is game, guys. That is game right there. So, GG. G, G. That is good. Uh, we literally used one item. We didn't have to. I did not need to use the item at all. But I did just because why not? I have it in. Why not use it? I mean, I was literally like, you know, why not use it? Whatever. But uh, technically we did with no items, you know, we didn't heal, I didn't pop any special, uh, you know, key item or attack boost item or defense boost, I didn't do anything in terms of like really helping myself out because the item reduced 25% um, attack from the enemy, but that was only for the first state of Buhan, the other Buhan didn't get that uh, debuff. So technically we fought him all the way through, technically without using the item. If you want to count the first item, whatever, I understand. But nonetheless, guys, pretty simple fight, pretty easy. Like I said, just a bit lengthy because we're using our full Wuhan team and we don't have the power of Silver God Link to mitigate his healing. But nonetheless, we got it done. So thank you once again for watching, guys. Please like, share, comment down below, guys. I'll see you next time.